Unbelievable. Well, I tell you, he knows how to drive a train. He swiped the manual out of shipping years ago. He's been reading them ever since. Hmm. Well, I was given this from a Vodakan escapee from Necromines. He died looking for us. Yeah, that's terrible. What's that? A map? Huh. I guess it is. And this came with it. Whoa! Creepy, right? Yeah, creepy. With his last breath, he said they're all dying. Well, who's dying? Our followers. They're all dying. What do you mean, our followers? I think he means, since we fled the farm, rumors have been spreading throughout the factories. The Dawkins have started escaping, and now they're trying to find us. I told you that would happen! Anything else? Well, I found some sick Mudakins. They escaped from other factories, but they were dying. All of them were dying. With their help, I discovered an antidote. They made some medicine, and it fixed them. But I still don't know why they got sick. Nothing else? He said we needed to... Find the Keeper. What's the Keeper? Um, what's it doing? Uh, I don't know. I... Whoa. Ooh, look at that. Look where it's shining. Even though the train is bouncing around, the light stays right on. Necrom. The Keeper? I hope it ain't telling us. The Keeper is in Necrom. Nobody wants to go to Necrom. It's like that, it's coming up. What are we gonna do? I also found another guy. He left a note for me. Said we gotta know what's on this tape. Is that an old play the tape? Not too old. They still using that communication up. Okay, looky here. Sling Barracks is the next stop on this line. It should have a communication outpost, shouldn't it? Yep. If we don't take out that comm tower, then every factory ahead of us, including Necro Mines, they're gonna know we coming. But first I gotta play this tape. Yep, you gotta play that tape. Can't figure it out. Come on, now oh, your Come moment. on, group, let's move it. You, 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 you. You, you, you. Supernatural.
several lightning strikes start fire. But did Moloch burn Ooh. down his Ooh. own farm? So far, that's what it's looking like. To be more accurate, it looks like he didn't just burn down that farm of his. He also killed over 300 of the poor mud's workers wow. for him. Oh, 300 lives yeah. gone up in smoke. Ooh. Don't make excuses for him. Ooh. Abe, but who is Abe? If even there is an Abe. You? Is this Abe guy dead all along with the rest of them? Does he ever really exist? With nothing but smoldering piles of bones, it will be impossible to truly know. But let's not forget about the plausible Patsy cover story of Moloch's defense. No one with half a brain believes that a lone Madoka-Labor has been taken down the cold, calculating brains of a glucken, let alone the star glucken of the investment markets, Moloch. Authorities verify that it doesn't really add up. Consider a mud trying to fight against a gluck. What world are you living in? What's next? Tin foil hats? Don't be that schmuck in your friend group. And well, that wasn't very productive. No! Oh, why? It's that aim guy right there. Hi, I'm here to hey. Let's get you out of here. Hi, Did anyone here. grab my mop when we left? Uh. I'm here to save you. Let's Follow me. Wait. I thought we were leaving. Come with me now. Oh, all right, then. We're free. All right, bye bye. I'm here to get you free. Where Let's are we going? Go. <laughs> you hear that? You hear <laughs> something? Come in there! <laughs> 
Uh-oh. I am the human tree. Oh, I'm gonna back you off the scrap cake.
Come on, now's your moment. We thought you'd never come! Save you. Follow me. Ugh! <laughs> 
investors of esteemed Magog Cartel. What I propose to you today is the ultimate employee performance and job retainment solution. For years, it has been my quest to find the upper limits of Mudokin labor capabilities, as well as their potential addiction dependencies, so that tomorrow, your conglomerates of factories may profit from maximized labor performance, chemically induced loyalty, and the end to labor escape whistleblowers, and those costly PR nightmare blowbacks. Only Soulstorm Brew takes performance, chemical dependency, and profitability to entirely new levels and sustains them. Our solution is simple. Two brews a day keeps job performance at peak operability. But if that laborer ever makes a run for it, within 48 hours of not having access to our beloved brew, their withdrawals will have kicked in and become so severe that in only a few hours, the little wannabe whistleblowing ingrates will be dead. Dying? They will not be running to cities because they will die before they ever get there. They will not be meeting with union representatives because they will never reach one. They will not be causing you PR nightmares because they will be dead. Oh no. The followers, they're all dying. From the broom! Yo, pray! Get figured out.